Hello children. Here I have taken lab activity of arithmetic progression. And what is that? Topic is arithmetic progression. And what to do? We have to verify that the sum of first and natural numbers is n n plus 1 by 2. How we are going to do it? By graphical method. You can take a graph paper or I am going to show you at the zero board. What is the pre-acquired knowledge we have natural numbers 1 2 3 4 to infinite we have we know already and we know that the area of square is side square and area of rectangles is length into breadth so all this we are going to use it now what are the materials required if you are taking geo board you are using online geo board then you only geo board is enough or you can do graph paper and colored pens so what we are going to do we will mark the numbers on the zero board now i am going to show you how to start this and then we discuss it i am here explaining you with the help of geo board it is online geo board you can see i am drawing axis y axis and x axis and uh, marking the points one two three like this now, after X and Y axis in online geo board, you have rubber bands also. You can use very easily. So, I am drawing rectangles. You see, it is 8 cross 1, then 7 cross 1, that is, width is rectangles, breadth is 8, and the uh, length is uh, 1 centimeter. So, this way I am drawing 8 cross 1 7 cross 1 like this different rectangles with the beautiful rubber bands so i complete here 4 cross 1 3 cross 1 and 2 cross 1 and 1 cross 1 that is and then we color it with different colors if you fill up the color we get like these rectangles different color rectangles you can use graph paper also but as it is online, uh, it is very easy to work on zero board. Now I mark here points on axis and so that it will be easy to count how many squares are shaded. So you can see numbering uh, with the help of pencil. I can write then it is 8 squares here of width 1 centimeter, side 1 centimeter. Same way others are 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So we have 8 rectangles and if you count number of squares 8 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 to 1. If you add it we are, 30, we are having with 36 squares of side 1 centimeter on this online zero board. Now let me know how many unshaded if you count unshaded squares we are getting same like you see here if i am putting here dots so and we count how many unshaded are there it is eight here first line seven six five four three two one what does it mean we have 36 squares shaded one and 36 squares unshaded one that means number of squares are same in shaded and unshaded region and what is the area of rectangle area is 8 cross 9 8 multiplied by 9 we have 72 total squares out of 36 shaded and 36 unshaded so here I am writing 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 8 if you add as here instead of n I have taken 8 so on x axis it is 8 till 8 I have marked and y axis 9. So it is n cross n plus 1. So we see that we had 36 squares. Total number of squares are 72. So shaded area will be half of the or shaded squares number of shaded squares will be half the total number of squares so if same way i am writing if 1 plus 2 plus 3 till 8 
is uh, is equals to half of 72 if i take instead of uh, n it will be half of n cross n plus 1 that is 8 cross 9 is 72 if instead of 8 it is n 9 will be n plus 1 so it is n into n plus 1 so what we have done we are in geo board we mark the rectangles now you have seen just we have marked the rectangles still uh, y axis till 9 and x axis along 8 and what you have done one by one we colored the rectangular stripes there are one centimeter stripe then two then three and we are coloring it in different colors and then at last we count that how many are colored and how many are total number and then we find out what is the relation between them you see that we have shaded squares is 36 and total number of square is 72 that means shaded square is half of the total number of squares so if i take total square is area of rectangle we have 8 and 9 length and width so it is 72 where is the shaded squares are just half of them so just instead of 8 and 9 if i take n is the 1 plus 2 plus 3 till n what is that it is area of rectangle will be n into n plus 1 so it is just half n into n plus 1 just instead of this I am putting the value of the algebraically. So, if I say mathematically, if area of biggest rectangle is 8 into 9, that is 72, and we have shaded region is 36. So, mathematically also, if you will see, it is just half. And if you count the area of shaded region, suppose 1 is there of 1 square unit, it is 1. Next one is 2, stripe is there. So, it is 2 into 1, 2 here and 1, again 3. So, then all, if you add all, it is total is 36. So, we are getting from both the equation 36. So, this way we verify that sum of n natural numbers is half n n plus 1.